Hey everyone, it's Matt the Crazy YouTuber. I'm not feeling as crazy today. Well, tonight. Um, I don't know if I already made like two videos today, I don't know, but if I didn't, this is my second video and it's not uplifting. Um, <sighs> I don't know, it's just I'm having one of those moments. I'm having those moments where I'm close to breaking down and not knowing what to do. And I'm sorry if I'm talking lower than usual. Well, you probably can't tell because of the mic, but um, my dad is in the next room and I really don't, I don't want him to know that I'm making a video because you know the problems I'm having with the whole YouTube thing and my parents. Um. So, um, as if you didn't know, I, I have depression, and it's getting worse every day. And every single day, I feel like shit, and I don't know what to do. And ever since my grandmother died last month, I have felt more like shit. Because the one person that I could talk to, besides my friends is gone and I can't talk to her anymore. So late and lately if you didn't know if I haven't messing mentioned this in my videos but but um my new videos but I haven't been really sleeping that well. I have been waking up early in the morning and I have been sleeping all day. And I don't normally sleep like that. Um but still, my sleeping schedule is shit, and I haven't really been eating as much as I used to. Um, and, by the way, I'm not, um, I know how everyone who, like, acts as if they're in distress, or they're in trouble, or they need help. Nowadays, people are using that as a publicity stunt, but I want to let you know, guys, that this is not a publicity stunt. Okay, I am not that kind of person to do that. I just thought I'd let you know, guys, that way you want to assume and make me feel more like shit. Um, as as you know, I came on YouTube because um because it was a way. It was one of the ways to get me to um. It was to get me away from reality. So I had, so I could have a place to go to where I can just let my thoughts out, and everyone, anyone who agreed with me would support me. And obviously, I was wrong, because at the time I didn't know, <laughs> I didn't know YouTube was very judgmental. <laughs> I was eleven when I first came on YouTube when I, well, not when I first came on YouTube, but I was 11 when I made, when I started making videos, so don't judge me too harsh. But, yeah. And, like I said, I'm sorry that I'm making a a video like this. Probably a video that you guys don't give two shits about. But, hey, people don't give two shits about my videos anyway. And that's just a fact. Um. And. I'm still, ha I'm still having problems with my parents coming to term with me being transgendered. And it drives me crazy every single time they they mention me as a female it just drives me crazy and I do not know what to do I mean I know I should either fight it or keep it to myself but I just I just don't know what to do I just I just want them to actually accept me for me but with all the with all the shit that's happening to me 
and all the shit that I'm going through right now. Let me tell you something. Well, first let me say my thing. If you're going through depression like I am, then you know the struggle of how it is every day. Or most of the time. Like, either every day or most of the time. You, it's just hard. It's just really hard to not break down. For me, every single day, it is a struggle for me. It is a struggle for me to not break down. And I'm not telling you this so that way you can pity me. I'm just, I'm just letting you know that this is what I'm going through. Okay, I'm not saying, hey, pity me. No. That's not it. It's just every single day. And my parents not may think that, well, my parents do think that I shouldn't have I have to deal with this, but apparently, but apparently me being a teenager, I have every right to be emotional, but there are other reasons why my depression is shit, and I don't really want to go into full detail about that. My The second channel was supposed to be about that. But considering YouTube said no because YouTube's a fucking dick, I can't do that. I can't tell my life story and why I feel this way and why I feel like shit every single day. Why it's a struggle for me to not break down in tears. Why it's a struggle to not pick up a razor again and start and start being a fucking cutter. I didn't like doing that, and I don't know why the hell I started it, but thank God I stopped. Like, I actually stopped myself. I didn't have someone tell me, you need to stop this. I literally stopped myself, because I saw what I was doing. I saw the stupid shit that I was pulling, and I didn't want to do that no more. So, I just said, enough's enough. Okay, it's just, it's stressful to hide them, and... No matter what what tutorial I saw in order to in order to find an easier way to hide them, I could not hide them. I could for a brief while, but but yeah. And I know I have support from my friends. And I had support from my grandmother. And I th and I hope I still have support from my grandfather. But, but I don't want that to be the only support I have. Is through my friends. I, I want support from my parents. And I want support from you guys. Because not only do I have my friends. But... Not only do I need my friends, but I also need you guys. It's I know it's just it's just a waste of time and me just asking you guys to give me support, but but yeah. And right now, it is really hard not to break down right now in front of camera. And I I do not have the confidence to do that. I will fight my eyes to stay dry. So, yeah. And I also want to apologize for the way I am. I'm sorry that I like to be myself. I'm sorry I'm not part of society. And I'm sorry I'm different from all of you guys. But that's just who I am. Everyone is flipping different. And not everyone is part of society. Not everyone. Not everyone follows the rule of God. Not everyone follows the fucking Bible. I sure as hell don't. Because in my honesty. What I, be what I actually believe is. Is you come out of your mother, you live this horrible life, and then, and then after that, there's darkness. But I give myself hope, and hope that there's no darkness, and that there's actually there's actually a light that everyone talks about, 
and then I get to actually see my grandmother again, and that that's that's just it. The only thing that's keeping me going is I don't want to disappoint my grandmother. She might be dead, but I but she's still looking down on me, and she's still giving me hope, and she's still there with me, and that's what's keeping me going. I do not want to disappoint my grandmother. I do not, and I don't think she'll be too happy seeing me so soon at, at a young age just because I was a pussy. I I don't want to disappoint my grandmother. I love her, but I'm also not desperate enough to meet her like that. Trust me, I thought of it, but I was like, no. And I could feel that she was pissing me for thinking about that. So I, I was just, I'm just like, you know what? I'm just gonna keep going, going. And also the fact that I, that my friends support me, and even my boyfriend. Even though, to be honest, when it comes to relationship, it's hard for me to tell, considering all the bad relationships I've been in. <sighs> so yeah. But yeah, that's all I wanted to say. I just wanted to get this off my chest. I don't know if I should be putting this on YouTube, but like I said, I just wanted to get this off my chest. Let you guys know what's going on. You can see, you can see that I'm starting to get bags under my eyes, and if my camera wasn't so shitty, you could see there's dark circles too. But yeah. Yeah, guys, like I said, I'm sorry I had to make this video. I'm s sorry that I just wasted your time, guys, but I just thought, hey. <sighs> but anyway, if you like this video and you agree with me, like, like this video, uh, comment, whatever you like. Just remember, if it's disrespectful, I will delete it just out of common sense. And, um, subscribe if you have it. Trust me, there's better videos than this one. So, uh, yeah. This is Monte Crazy YouTuber. Sign out.